Thank you. Over 100 animals were rescued on Friday from a Milwaukee home that acted as a makeshift pet store. And among those animals, dogs, birds, bunnies, a turkey, even a gator. Our CBS 58 Yukari Nakayama talked to the organization that's now helping the animals find homes. <laughs> At one time, this unique group of animals all lived under one roof. It was dogs, <laughs> cats, parrots, all kinds of pairs, all sizes, um, all kinds of reptiles, chinchillas, rabbits, guinea pigs. Until last Saturday when Milwaukee police executed a search warrant in a Milwaukee home for an animal cruelty investigation, rescuing 112 animals. This is the, the most unique kind of hoarding situation I've ever dealt with. <laughs> Karen Sparapani of the Milwaukee Area Domestic Animal Control Commission describing the home environment as unkept and unlivable for these animals. It wasn't, you know, like a week of negligence. I mean, this was many weeks. And the, the dogs, when my staff got all the dogs out on Friday night, they were covered head to toe in poop. She said the owner was running a pet store from his home. This was a person that was trying to um, run a business. Uh, he had a pet store. And um, I think this is where, you know, he was, you know, letting life happen to create inventory for his store. Sparapani said luckily most of the animals they rescued are doing okay and does not believe the animals were stolen. Sparapani says the DA is currently looking into that situation, the possible charges still unknown. If you're going to add pets to your life, be, be able to manage them. And if you're going to have a business of animals, invest in your business. Now those reptiles and bunnies will be given to local agencies while those dogs and cats will be ready for adoption soon. Here in Milwaukee, Yukari Nakayama, CBS 58 News.